Well, y'all, I went and uh, broke down and bought a wood splitter. Trying this thing out. It was supposed to come with free hydraulic fluid. Well, I thought I had some in it, but apparently it showed in the bottom hose. Apparently they put like one gallon in there or two or something. I had to go out and buy $82 worth of hydraulic fluid. But this is a Crimson Force 32-ton log splitter. Crazy thing is, went down to Rural King to buy this thing. And I didn't want to buy this one. I wanted to buy the 27 ton because I could have got it for $900. Uh, it was on sale for $849. Well, get up there. Spent an hour and a half in the store talking to these people. This was the only log splitter they had. I don't like the way the engine sounds. It does have a Kohler on it. And the pump, it's needing broke in right now. So that's what I'm doing. Drove it back on the back road all the way. Either way, I got this one for cost. Uh, looked on his thing. It was $1,000. I think $1,005 it cost. I got... I walked out of there after taxes and everything for $1,062, I think. I mean, that's pretty good. But we're going to break this one in and see. I do not like, I like everything else about this except for the noise and how they mounted this on the bottom. If this thing's idling, the whole engine, just where it goes back right there, need a bigger piece of metal right there. And uh, the whole thing bounces. I mean, bounces bad at idle. Shake, it's like it's going to shake apart. Other than that, I like the design because everything's easy to access on this thing. Uh, the hoses could be a little bit better. I don't like how I can actually lose a log from right here and hit the hoses down here. Might break something. Better be a heavy log break sign, though. But they do have all that on there. And I don't like how the engine is not shrouded. So I'm going to put something across the engine just to bolt down. I might just extend this on out and just bolt it up to it and just extend it over the engine so it don't mess it up. Other than that, that's about it. We'll see if this thing blows up next couple of days. I got a little bit more wood here to split and some out back and then we'll go get some more for the winter. All right, I just wanted to show you all my new, uh, new. oh yeah, there's the, uh, don't recommend frame to nobody, but this was hydraulic fluid, so no big deal. Don't do no oil filters, people. Either way, right there's the five gallons of oil. I got about a gallon left now of hydraulic fluid. But this seems like a good deal. Uh, it was Black Friday deal on it. I think it was, I can't remember the regular price or else I'd tell y'all. But just wanted to show y'all. Y'all enjoy. Have a good day. We'll see what I buy next, I guess, or project, or who knows. Might buy a cow. Who knows? See y'all next time. Enjoy.